Taking you to new heights this morning, a hands-on learning experience about the creation flying machines. 2 News reporter Patricia Santos is live with more on this one-of-a-kind exhibit. Hey, Brian. good morning. Well, my first lesson was learning how to make a paper airplane, and I got some help from some of the things behind here, some of the exhibits here. Uh, Kim Jones, talk to me about this. You, he, by the way, he helped me with this because I was even confused making a paper airplane. This is an awesome exhibit. Talk to me about it. Well, uh, as you saw, it, it takes a little skill in uh, some of them to make the paper airplanes, but once they're made, then they can test them out here on our paper airplane launchers. Uh, we also have uh, rockets that they can make their own rockets, put them on the little uh, launch pad, pump it up, and shoot those rockets. We have helicopters. It's a great exhibit. This is the, the idea behind this is what? To help kids understand math, science? Exactly. These are, uh, they're learning math and science whether they realize it or not, but it's a fun, hands-on way to do that. And this exhibit is called Take Flight. It comes to us from the Hands-On Museum in Ashland, Oregon, and it will be here through November 3rd. Okay, and we want to show you what we can do with these planes because it's not just a fancy plane. Go ahead and take your <laughs> place here. We're going to go ahead. Um, wait, do we push the button first? Push your button. Okay. Yep. And then... Go from the rear and... Hey, there we go. Did you get that? that Flying plane. Yeah, I know it. <laughs> and I know we were talking about uh, Neil Armstrong really quickly. You have an exhibit that also shows what he did. We, uh, we actually had Neil Armstrong here in uh, Tulsa Air and Space Museum uh, about a year and a half ago. He was here for a private after-hours event. But it was really neat because we had a group of uh, Booker T. Washington uh, Air Force ROTC students in here helping man the exhibits for the guests. And he agreed to have his picture taken and with those kids. And that's not something he does often. No. All right. Brianne, we'll send it back to you. Thanks so much, Patricia. You know, you can see the take.